Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedi again. We're back with our Pro Tools uh, tutorials. Today we're going to learn how to use the Big Counter in Pro Tools. So the Big Counter, okay? Think about a counter just like the one you have here, but it's huge. Now why would you need it? And how do you show it? How do you use it? Well, very simple, okay? You can simply go to Window, Window Menu, and select Big Counter. Or you can use the key command, Command 3 from the numeric keypad if you're in a Mac, or Control 3 on the numeric keypad if you're in a PC. Now, if you click on it, here it is. It's just a counter, but it's big, okay? Um, as you can see, we're showing... Uh, bars, beats, and ticks. But this can be changed, okay? You can click on this little arrow here, then switch it to minutes and seconds, uh, time code, feet, frames, or samples. Now, um, a couple things here. Um, if you don't want to see ticks or milliseconds, in case of um, the minute seconds option, you can just click here, hide ticks and milliseconds. That way, if you're like here, you'll see bars and beats. Now, why um, you need it? Well, first of all, you can resize it and make it as big as you want, right? Now, why would you use this big counter for? Well, here's the answer. Let's say you are recording. Uh, you're in a recording studio and you have two different rooms. You have a control room where the engineer and the producers are and you have a tracking room where the musicians are. If they are reading music or some kind of chart, it would be really helpful for them to have some kind of screen or TV or monitor where they could see a counter, okay? They could see where they are as far as a song. And what you would do in this case, if you had your computer and you had a second monitor, um, on, in the tracking room, you would simply click and drag this to that monitor and they would see that big, okay? It's just a visual rep uh, reference, it's just a vis visual cue so they know uh, where they are, you know, approximately within the song, okay? So that's, that's that, that's the big counter. Once again, if you're just working by yourself in a single room, you're mixing, you're mastering, editing. You don't really need it. You can see your counter from here, okay, from your edit window or from your transport bar. But if you have dual screens and you want someone to, someone to see it in the other room, once again, you can just show it by going to window, big counter, or uh, command three or control three, depending on Mac or PC systems. So that's the big counter from Pro Tools. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedient PC Audio Labs and we'll be happy to help you. We will see you guys soon. Bye bye. Want to learn how to produce music using this or using that or using all of these? Have you been watching videos, reading manuals, blogs, and trying to figure out everything that it takes to be a music producer? Do you have a bunch of music gear that you purchased and you still haven't made any music? Well, then you need Obedia, the world's only one-on-one -on -one digital audio training and tech support service. Check out the link below for a special new subscriber offer.